the Madonna of the Trail, is a ten-foot-tall, five-ton statue shrouded in mystery. This ten-foot-tall beauty has two amazing coincidences surrounding her. And if you stick with me to the end, there's a third coincidence that is guaranteed to blow your mind. Okay, here we are at the DAR website. This is the Daughters of the American Revolution. And then if we start here with the National Society, we just mouse over it, and then you can go down here to the Historic Sites and Properties. And this is the interactive map, and you can pick whatever state you want. I'm going to pick the state that I live in, in Arizona, and that's where we found out about the Madonna of the Trail, in Springerville, Arizona. The Madonna of the Trail was one of 12 statues that was put along the National Old Trail Road, Route 40. The statues were dedicated from 1928 to 1929. The statue we're going to be looking at is in Springerville, Arizona. Springerville, Arizona is a small town in eastern Arizona. According to the latest census in 2010, the population is 1,961 people. If we look at what's going on here, we really only see two things happening here. We see the statue, the Madonna of the Trail, and then we see some ancient ruins. The Kiva at Casa Malpice. It says that Casa Malpice is located near Springerville and it is a nationally recognized archaeological site. It goes on to further say that both the Hopi and the Zuni people still consider Casa Malpice a sacred ancient place. Now is this an amazing coincidence or what? Here it is. The only two things going on in this town is the Madonna of the Trail and then an ancient runes that's considered sacred by both the Hopi and the Zuni. So let's go ahead and check out this Casa Malpice and see what it is. Casa Malpice was built around 1260 and was inhabited until about 1400. And it is one of the latest dated Mongolian sites. If that's how you say that, Mongolon, Mongolon sites. Let's look up and see what the Mongolon culture is. The Mogollon culture is one of the major prehistoric southwestern cultural divisions of the southwestern United States and northern Mexico. The site that we're looking at right here, here's the Arizona border, and we're right around in here. And this is right in the middle of the Mogollon culture. What kind of stuff did the Mogollon culture do? Well, let's take a look at it. They did the cliff dwellings. They built uh, adobe buildings. Does this look familiar? They built pottery. Here's a close-up of some of their uh, castles they built. So this is a pretty extensive uh, culture. So if we look back here where we're at, right up in here, this is major coincidence number two. Here we are right in the middle of some really amazing uh, ancient sites. This is absolutely amazing. Now, as promised, the third and final coincidence, the one that is going to blow your mind. This statue is on the Devil's Highway. It was renamed because of the satanic connection combined with a high fatality rate compounded by persistent sign theft. This is called Historic U.S. Highway 666 on vintage postcards. So we go down, we're looking at the um, Eager, Arizona to Loopton, Arizona. Eager was uh, just above or just below the the Springvale so it goes from Eager through Springvale and up to Loopton and we can see this the Springerville is a 
big part of the section because there's one, two, three, four, five, six postcards about Springerville, Arizona, along the route 60, along route 666, and three of them have the uh, Madonna of the Trail. Okay, if we look down here, we can see in the third postcard, we'll see a little more information here. It says Springerville, Arizona, served by highways US 60, US 180, Park to Park Highway 666, famous Colorado Trail. And then it's got a description of what the postcard looks like. Uh, it was created in the early 1960s. Here's a picture of it. You can see there's the Madonna of the Trail there and the post office and government building and a First National Bank sign and then you can kind of see right here South 666. There it is. Coincidence or conspiracy? You decide.